Hey, there's good names, and welcome back to the Daily Advice. Today, with the latest update, I have a deer trap. So, what this is using is a catapult arm and a catapult rope. So, previously, I've been seeing a lot of attempts using uh, trees, using catapult ropes to try and trap deers using weird chain like substances because the non dynamic ropes, and if they ever become dynamic ropes, you won't actually be able to cut them because. Basically, the dynamic. So what I have here, just to arts it up, I have a whole bunch of the trebuchet prongs. They like this place. I wonder if can I can chase you in. I have a whole bunch of prongs, as if they were daggers or something. They do this a lot. Just stand there. Turn this way. Run around. Run around. Never really tried this. I've always been placing them down. One hit a tree. Okay, I'll show this now. I'll have this random footage. Oh, I'm getting close. Random footage from when a deer hit a tree. They're just running around. I don't have it actually hidden it. But when the deer went off into the trap. Oh, stalking a deer. So fun. Never thought this would have happened in the game. Deer. Hit trap, hit trap, hit, no, deer hit tree, tree broke. The deer I'm stalking is now gone. Well, that's fantastic. Deer hit tree, tree broke, and there's debris still in that world just sitting there. Fun times. So now I'm going to have to spawn in deer. Thank you for that random one. Oh, come on, you just walk away. You notice things with these weird AI. Well, not weird. Actually, nice and fun. Nice and fuzzy if you can pet them. <sighs> Let's try this out. It will cut the rope. The rope is attached straight to the arm. It, I have a whole back piece that extends beneath where the uh, actual killing arm is so that it has a degree of force on it. Ooh, let's get you cornered. So fun. It's practically looking at me. Run, run. That's how much far away you run. Nah, deers today. So, well, if I stand up. Pew. Of all the deer, of all the world, you had to walk into my life. Yeah. So now I'm standing up, I can actually show you what this contraption how it works basically so this is the arm that extends beneath where the catapult arm is it freely swings about in this area not hitting any trees i did have to take one down it's just laying there hello tree that's a cuttable rope so the tension is pulling away from that stand when that's hit this will swing 45 and 90 what is that 135 degrees because that's the range of motion with the tree with the catapult arms and hopefully whack the deer unlike that last one which was kind of a lucky deer who would expect i've had a lot of just ones that just walked into this just on their merry way which is really nice to see that deers actually will walk around in a world that you set them up in so let's try this again stand up nope Cut to the time that it works. So this is trial five. Was I coming at the wrong angle? No, I believe they weren't. So where to go right there? Oh, by the neck. Almost decapitation, but they don't have separate limbs. Ah, so rewarding. Look at all that venison. <laughs> Legs straight up. So rewarding. So that's the working deer catcher showing you off right here before you. Eyes, 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 eyes. Copy. Thank you. Eight, me. Thank you very much. With a deer. Interesting. 
So once again, thanks for watching this daily advice. As usual, there'll be another one out tomorrow. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you did indeed like this advice. If you do have any suggestions on advice or something you would like me to look into, please do add that in the comments. And I'll see you in the next one.